praise the Lord, mighty prophet of the Lord. Amen. Now uh, the Lord has spoken at me. The Lord Jehovah Elohim. Jehovah Hosseinu. Jehovah Adonai. Jehovah Sabaoth. Jehovah Roshi. Jehovah El Olam El Yon. He has spoken with me today uh, about what is coming to South Africa. Praise the Lord, mighty prophet of the Lord. Amen. Now, uh, the Lord has spoken with me. The Lord Jehovah Elohim. Jehovah Hosseinu. Jehovah Adonai. Jehovah Sabaoth. Jehovah Roshi. Jehovah El Olam El Leon. He has spoken with me today uh, about uh, what is coming to Mexico. In the conversation of this day, the, the Lord took me to Mexico. They could see a lot of activity in Mexico, a lot of immorality in Mexico the dressing of the women, the young men, and just the general behavior, people immoral, walking around. There's a lot of immorality and lack of godliness. And also, the Lord showed me the people of Mexico mocking God. I see this particular uh, people mocking God. I see also broadcasting on something that is looks like he's mocking God. I don't know what program it is, but look like I had the voice say satire. And then after that, the voice of the Lord spoke judgment to Mexico in this dream. After showing me the people in their immorality, the church is full of false apostles, false prophets, and uh, a lot of deception, the gospel that puts the church, keeps the church away from righteousness. The gospel that hides away holiness from the sheep, from the population, from the land. And a lot of false apostles and false prophets in Mexico, in the evangelical churches, the Baptist churches, the Pentecostal churches, and then also Catholicism and all their practice. The Lord spoke against all these religions there. And then the climax of it is uh, that I had these people who were telling me that, uh, look, they are broadcasting some satire, some satire against the Lord. And then I realized that this satire was also against the servant of the Lord in Mexico. And then after that, the voice of the Lord spoke judgment in that dream. Then I saw historic floods come to Mexico. Historic floods, so big, so big restaurants, shops, what people now could not access to the extent that people could not access their homes and their businesses. Through the front door, I see people using spiral stairs now, which is the exit route in case of a fire from their homes, from their offices, and to such a situation in Mexico. So there is a judgment of the Lord that is coming to Mexico because of the ungodliness that has been established in that land. The Lord is speaking with me, has spoken with me now about Mexico, and the judgment of God, the Lord Jehovah, is coming to Mexico because of immorality in the land. The women are walking almost nude in that country. There's so much prostitution, homosexuality, and all these things. And so the Lord has decided that this is the hour to bring judgment over Mexico. And when the judgment does happen, floods come. They see a lot of people deplorable conditions, water flows, flood their homes, flood their businesses, 
specialized. So a lot of businesses, the restaurants, uh, people are trying to get evacuated. People could not access their homes also. They were using the spiral stairs, the metal that is put for exit outside, which is uh, normal as a back. They could not access their homes anymore through the front door. And tremendous, very massive destruction. Shalom.